Hello all you slick cerebellums and welcome to the first video in a new series I'm going to be doing simply called stories. These can be stories that range from the coolest moments you've ever experienced playing an MMO to just straight up drama or even heartwarming stories of triumph over impossible odds. Some will be MMO specific like Wrath stories or ESO stories or etc. And some may be just general MMO RPG stories that are just cool. I mean, really isn't that what MMOs are for? Creating memories and moments we never forget and doing these things with each other. That's what it's all about as far as I can tell. Remember to give that subscribe a gentle little tickle and flick that like button because if you do I will for sure send you a real life Pokemon in the mail that will be hand selected by Sandalio, a Mexican fellow that I know that works at my local dine mall. Today's topic was simply what was some cool stories you have about WoW Wrath Classic or the OG08 version of Wrath of the Lich King. Our first story comes from Rolling Hammer. This is just a funny anecdote between some friends I played WoW with back in 2005-2010. We had one friend that was hardcore back in vanilla. He completed every raid, including Naxxramas at 60. He would tell us about how hard it was, how much prep they did, etc. When the new Naxxramas Wrath version came out, we were all pretty excited to see the things he would talk about back then. Of course, it was much easier than he had described, which led everyone to kind of side-eye him and wonder if he had been exaggerating the whole time. Guys, they made it way easier, I promise. Eventually, we did some research and he was vindicated, but I'll never forget him desperately trying to convince us that the level 60 Nax was much harder than the raid we were currently progressing through. We did wipe a bunch, but were surprised at how many bosses we killed. I somewhat noticed this myself as I'd just recently done Dead Mines on Wrath of the Lich King Classic, and I know and I remember Dead Mines from the classic version, which I played a lot, and it even on the lowest tier dungeon, I could see the difficulty difference. It was way easier to get through much faster, it seemed like, than it was in vanilla or the classic version. So yeah, I noticed that as well. But yeah, it has to do with the power scaling. I'm pretty sure between vanilla and wrath, it wasn't designed for the wrath stats and all that stuff. But yeah, it's still kind of funny having to try to convince your guys, <laughs> your team that, no, this was way harder before. This was way harder, I swear. <laughs> Next story comes from work throwaway 619. Back in ICC, my raid leader had a really short fuse. One of the most memorable things my cousin and I still reminisce about is him yelling, we're going to rot face after wiping on fester gut for quite some time. The way he said it was absolutely hilarious to us and we still quote it to this day. That would be pretty funny. One of my other favorite moments was from Wintergrass. I played on Spinebreaker which was a most mostly horde server at the time. In Wintergrass, the Alliance would get a crap ton of stacks of tenacity because they were outnumbered by us all the time. And tenacity actually increases your health, your health regen, amount of healing received, and I think damage dealt. So <laughs> we'd be fighting druids and warriors with 100k health who would, have, who would two shot us. It was a blast. This is the attitude to have, right? Just, just look at that and be like, Okay, these guys are stacking this and they're blasting us. This is insane. But this would, I mean, I could, I'm glad he can see the humor in that. That's what we need more of. Just kind of laughing at situations like that. We are at the moment now in the video, guys, where I like to take a look at some memes and just laugh and goof with you guys. These are pretty funny, I think. So let's take a look at some of these memes. Usually these memes will be associated with the MMO or the topic that we're talking about. In some cases, they might not be. It's just a funny little segment in the video I like to do. Paladins after giving kings. It ain't much, but it's honest work. Dude, it's true. Hey, we got to get some more paladin love out there. I'm a paladin, okay? I love giving my kings out. I love it. It's great. I forget, though, really bad because I'm the brain of a, of a cockroach. <laughs> but it's still... Hey, this is true, though. I feel like a king. I feel like... A, I kind of like, I feel like I'm, I kind of do feel like I'm a farmer and I kind of feel like I'm farming, farming love and admiration from my, from my group. Guys literally only want one thing and it's disgusting. I do for you. I swear it's true. Hey, hey man, it is what it is, dude. You can't hate. You can't hate, man. You, you can't. This is whenever someone brings up the like, <laughs> brings up classic era doing well. Guys, classic era is thriving. But how's Uldor going for you guys? 
Guys, can you not hear me? I said classic air is thriving. It's not dead, thriving. <laughs> hey, you know what though? That, I think it's really cool that it's driving. It's the hard, I think it's the hardcore scene driving it a lot. I, I mean, I'm the guy who's like thumbs up and having fun over on Wrath, but like, just, I do think it's really cool that classic's popping off like it is. I think that's gonna be nothing but good for the game personally. <laughs> And I mean, to be fair, I'm honestly thinking about doing a hardcore run anyway. So you guys let me know in the comments what you think about that. Raid leader explains boss mechanics. My brain. That's, that's way too true, dude. That's my brain most of the time. That's my brain like most of the time. This is my brain. This is my brain when I'm trying to edit and write scripts too. <laughs> all right, guys, all right. Let's move on to another story in our wrath stories, our third story, our last story in the video. And this story comes from Lower Possibilities 826. My moment was back in Wrath of the Lich King, not the current one. When I had put in the most hours in WoW and did a raided arena, I played Rhett Paladin. Hey, that's a good choice, brother. And went with a friend of mine that played Frost DK versus two sub rogues. They bursted down my friend so quick that even after he popped his trinket, he was back into a CC chain while I was blinded and <laughs> sapped while my wings were fading. Jeez, <laughs> once he was dead, they swapped to me. Now it's 2v1, Rhett Pally versus two sub rogues. And I had no trinket and no burst. Let's just say, after I killed both of them with about 10% HP left on myself, it was <laughs> I was in a state of euphoria. I can imagine because I, I don't know how you won that. I cannot fathom how you pulled that win off. But the fact that you did alone is pretty impressive. That, that should be a for sure loss. But you pulled it off with 10% HP, and that's pretty impressive. My friend, that was pretty, pretty impressive. I would say... Uh, I would probably be in a state of euphoria as well, but that's what these kind of that's what these moments create man These moments create this kind of you know awesome these awesome scenarios that we that are just organic and you just can't make up They just happen on their own I would love to hear some stories from you guys down in the comment section about some moments You had playing wrath of the lich king classic or the 08 version I would love to read through these and maybe we'll do some more We were definitely going to be doing more of these videos So maybe we'll feature some of your guys' stories in these videos But I would I would love to share these moments with the world because this is the pinnacle of mmos This is what mmos are all about man. I, at least that's what I think. I think mmos are all about this So if you guys like like this give it a like give it a subscribe if you want to see more of this stuff this was really fun i hope you enjoyed this it, whatever this video is it's the first one so it's probably <laughs> we'll see how this goes but i hope you guys did enjoy it hope you got something out of it much love to you guys and i'll see you on the next one peace